Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Jenny and I'm the Mind and Body Coach. Just thought I'd take this video as a bit of time to tell you what it is I do and how I came to do it. Um, I started off, um, I've always been really into fitness. I grew up horse riding and going to gymnastics, doing a bit of dance at school. And then uh, at the age of 17 I had problems with my knees and I had to give up horse riding, which has been like a massive part of my life until then. Uh, luckily, about the same time, I got a job at a gym, just on reception, and then I just fell in love with that kind of training as well, just like doing cardio and weights, and then I just discovered classes. So I used to go to the gym all the time. Fast forward, I went to university and studied psychology, which I absolutely loved, but I wasn't quite sure what I wanted to do with it. Had a year off, went travelling, as you do, <laughs> and moved to London. Uh, got a job as a PA in an office and office life just wasn't for me. I hated being cooped up. I used to go to the gym every lunch and after work and just to do something. And then I thought, oh, why don't I make this my career? Uh, did my personal training qualification. And then even then I didn't actually get a job as a personal trainer for a couple more years. I just didn't have the confidence to go out there. It just seemed really scary. Um, eventually I got a job at Virgin Active in Clapham. And uh, that's where I just completely fell in love with the job. I used to do did all the courses you could do. I did zoo, which is like animal flow, um, kettlebells, advanced kettlebells, TRX, everything that I could do. I just loved studying. And then I, but I still had this kind of niggling feeling of just like not feeling confident, not feeling good enough. So I, and first of all, it started off with um, working with people with back pain. So I thought, oh no, I'll do my Pilates course. Then I'll feel confident working with people with back pain did my Pilates course, it enhanced my knowledge of anatomy massively and I did feel more confident working with people. But I still had this niggling sense that I just wasn't good enough, it's, I didn't know what I was talking about, this kind of imposter fit syndrome. So then I got interested in NLP, which is Neuro Linguistic Programming. It's all about resetting the brain and it's all about our filters. So when we take in information, we apply filters to it and those filters sometimes aren't actually serving us and they can be negative. So you, it's the things like mind reading, so you, someone does something and you presume it's because of something that it's actually completely unrelated to. So I studied NLP, absolutely loved that, and it mass, massively helped me with my confidence. Um, I also did life coaching, and so the coaching was again just to combine with the personal training because I realised that some people... They will say they want to change, but, and you tell them what to do and they don't do anything. And I realised that just having that time in the gym is just not enough. If people aren't doing the work outside the gym, then they're never going to get to their goals. So I kind of came up with the concept of combining the NLP um, with the coaching as well as the PT, so the one-to-one -one sessions, because I really enjoy working in the gym, I love working with people. So then I kind of came up with this product where you combine everything. And then on top of that, because I do love a course, um, I recently went to India to do my yoga teacher training. It's something I wanted to do for ages, but it just didn't feel like the right time. I wasn't even sure if I wanted to teach. I just thought I wanted to keep yoga for me. I've been doing it since I was 18. I won't tell you how long that was. And um, I just decided, yeah, I wasn't quite sure if I wanted to teach. Going to India, it seemed scary. And I'd also, though, at this time, kind of got into this weird cycle where I was so regimented on my routine, the thought of giving it up and going to India where everything was kind of out of my control was really scary. But then I realised that this is actually one of the reasons why I definitely should go. And um, that trip, completely life-changing. It's just, yeah, it's amazing. I just got into my meditation, so now I do that every morning. I'm sleeping for the first time ever, properly through the night, going to sleep when I go to bed. And I just feel more at peace and I just absolutely loved it. And from that, I realized I did want to teach yoga as well because I can see firsthand the sort of impact and the benefits it brings to you. So now I kind of do a bit of everything. So there's like the coaching, the personal training, Pilates and yoga, the NLP and, the, and everything else. Because I get bored easily, I love all different types of training. I love a bit of hit, I love weights, I love a CrossFit, and I love the yoga. And I just think it's good to have a bit of variety. But I definitely, for me, the biggest, um, the most important thing for me is yoga, because it's a mind and body complete package. It's a science, but also it's, it's the mental training. It's being at one, just moving meditation, 
not thinking for some time and really connecting the mind and body together because most of us are really disjointed. So that is me.